This is a video to help understand how to use the FT70 for Wires X control. In order to enable Wires X control, you will be intending to change rooms or disconnect rooms that are currently being used on the repeater or node. First, be sure you're on the frequency you need to be to operate Wires X control. There are some basic features about the FT70. It's friendly and much easier to use for Wires X, but it does not offer some of the features that the other radios do. This is not a disadvantage. Its simplicity offers some advantages. Notice that when accessing Wires X, you're basically using the function key, the AMS key, the mode key, and the band key, along with scrolling. So these outside keys are your primary keys. When we access Wires X control, what we are doing is first of all pushing the F key and then AMS. Notice it toggles the information on the air. Wires shows on the display and then connected. It shows connected node spark room. I've connected us to a room with no users so we don't get interrupted in this video. So the spark room is an indication here of the room we are in and now we are able to find out how to change rooms by dialing and scrolling through the options the radio gives us. First of all, it shows us the room we're on, Spark Room. Then we have five different memory slots. The first three here are unused. Number four, I have already stored Spark Room. And number five, I have already stored America Link. So let's say at this point, I've been in the spark room now, but there's no activity, and I want to use this repeater on America Link. I've dialed it to that position, number five. All I need to do now is push AMS key. Notice the information goes out over the air, and now it is connected to America Link. So you can leave it in that position depending upon how the node is set up with timers and it may resort back to the original position later. But for now, it gives you America Link and you're free to use it as you need to. If you decide or choose at this point you no longer want to be connected to America Link, you can disconnect by holding down the band key. And now it has disconnected us. It's given us that visual information on the display. Now we're back to choosing no connected node, America Link was the last node, slots 1, 2, 3, or stored here with Spark Room, or stored here with America Link. I'm going to dial back to Spark Room, and I'm going to push the AMS key, and now we are going to return to the Spark Room. Once I am finished, and I've done what I wanted to with Wires X, simply hold down the mode key and it will restore you back to normal radio operation. There are a couple of things to be aware of. First of all, when you're using Wires X commands, it's not unusual for the transmission to not accomplish the purpose you want. There is no error correction on this mode. Even with strong signals, there are times where you just simply have to try again. At very worst, back out of Wires X completely by pushing down the mode key and going back to the radio mode. Then simply once again function AMS and talk to the node system and the response is there. You're now connected. And once again you can decide what you wish to do with the node. The realization too that you cannot call back information other than what you already see means you have to know ahead of time what rooms you wish to connect to and their accompanying number. So when you go into the direct entry screen, which is here, EN for entry, you'll want to know from the Yesu cataloging website the list of rooms and which ones you want to connect to. I keep a list of my most used rooms handy on my phone, since I can't remember the numbers all the time, to quickly look them up. There's generally only about uh, seven rooms or so at most I ever use but you'll want to store them on the radio for your convenience as well. So let's say we wish to enter a room here. 
I'm going to use uh, Minwis as an example. Two, one, four, nine, three, and then AMS to enter. We've now connected and it shows we are on Minwis. I'm going to store that into memory three. Hold it down and I spoke over the beep but I believe it beeped back to confirm it. Let's take a look. One, two, and there three is Minwis. So this FT70 is actually the most friendly Wires X control as far as the Acer radio design because it's so simple and straightforward. I generally grab it first when I want to make a quick Wires X change because it is so simple. The other radios can be used in a more simple fashion but none are this easy. It's possible that the mobiles that are more simplified are easy like this as well, but I'm unfamiliar with them. This is just to give you the basic ideas. Use your FT70 Control Wires X, and it's a very simple process once you get to know it. Let's end that process, hold down Mode, and we have removed ourselves from the Wires X mode. We're back into normal radio mode. Hopefully this helps you practice and eventually it'll become second nature.